raffle to honor this year's recipients of the Adolf de Graui Legacy Award and Honorary Cavaliers. We would like to call your attention to the track so we can recognize them. The Adolf de Graui Legacy Award is presented to Cavalier alumni who have dedicated years of service and left a legacy of changing the organization for the better. Adolf de Graui's involvement the Cavaliers includes having been marching a marching member, Cavalier Cadets Director, Cavaliers Director, and both Vice President and President of the Board of Directors. During his time as Director, the Corps saw a resurgence into the top tier of competitive drum corps groups. De Graui's impact is still felt by the Corps today, and his namesake award is reserved for individuals who have left a powerful mark on the organization. We would like to welcome this year's winners. First, Dave Flynn. Dedicated seven years marching with the Cavaliers, rising from snare drummer to drum major, returning years later as a board member, he spearheaded modernization efforts and founded Green Thunder Percussion, later Cavaliers Indoor, a successful program that nurtured local talent for the Cavaliers. Dave also championed the organization's shift to a governance model, attracting diverse expertise and fueling substantial growth. His unwavering commitment to giving back and providing steady leadership epitomizes the core values the Cavaliers aim to instill in its members. Once again, Dave Flynn. And next, Mr. Jim Roussel. Jim Roussel was a dedicated member of the Cavaliers from 1965 to 1970, earning the Cavalier of the Year Award before enlisting in the Marines. After a distinguished military career with the Marines, Jim returned to the Cavaliers as a percussion caption head and later as Corps Director, leading the Corps to competitive success. After briefly working in the airline industry, he returned to the Cavaliers, building performance quality and the core reputation before retiring again to focus on his police career and family. He maintained involvement via generous donations, coordinating reunions, and providing support when asked. Drum Corps fans, Mr. Jim Roussel. And next, Mr. Frank Speciali. Frank marched with the Cavaliers in 1955 and 1956, and his influence remains significant today. He was instrumental in establishing a relationship between the Cavaliers and the village of Rosemont, starting with an introduction to Mayor Donald E. Stevens in 1981. This connection led to a 40 plus year sponsorship, greatly benefiting the Corps. Frank served on the Cavaliers Board of Directors for over 20 years, frequently assisted on tours, and proudly showcased the Corps in Rosemont. His legacy lives on through his family's involvement in Drum Corps and his enduring contributions to the Cavaliers. Frank's family is here this evening to accept his award in memoriam. Thank you. Next. The title Cavalier is reserved for those who marched in the Cavaliers Drum and Bugle Corps at any point, with the exception of Honorary Cavalier Award recipients. The Honorary Cavalier Award is presented to nominated individuals who, for a minimum of 10 years, generously contribute their time and dedication to the Drum Corps. The Cavaliers are incredibly proud to bestow this hard-earned honor to our most dedicated staff and volunteers. First recipient, Mr. Richard Saucedo. A renowned figure in the music and marching band world, served as the director of bands and performing arts department chairman at Carmel High School in Indiana for 31 years, earning national recognition for his ensembles. As the brass arranger and composer for the Cavaliers, Richard's work, starting with the 2000 program Niagara Falls, helped elevate the core musicianship and contributed to the multiple DCI World Championship titles. 
Richard returned as the Cavaliers Brass Arranger for the 75th anniversary in 2023, demonstrating his deep connection to the core spirit and energy. Mr. Saucedo. <laughs> Dr. Alan Miko. Dr. Miko has been a vital supporter of the Cavaliers Medical Group, the Cape Board of Directors, and the Cavaliers members since his son Alex joined in 2015. He contributes his medical expertise and dedication to the Corps, touring with them for at least 10 days each summer, including the challenging Texas Swamp Week, and assisting with winter camps. Dr. Miko also serves on various subcommittees of the Cape Board of Directors, exemplifying the highest ideals of Cavaliers through his volunteer efforts. His commitment extends beyond his medical contributions, playing a crucial role in the Cavalier Medical Group and the Greater DCI Marching Arts Safety and Health Group. Dr. Miko. <laughs> Special thanks to all of our honored Cavaliers. Thank you. August 10th, on the day of the DCI World Championship Finals, downtown Indianapolis will be rocking with the return of the Sound Sport International Music and Food Festival. Bigger and better than ever, join us just outside Lucas Oil Stadium for Sound Sport and Drumline Battle performances with a collection of gourmet food trucks, exhibitors, and much more adding to the festivities. Visit DCI.org for more information on these exciting events and for a complete schedule of world championship events. Drum Corps International would like to thank members of the Friends of DCI for their continued support. Annual contributions from Friends of DCI members help to guarantee that future generations of performers enjoy the opportunity to achieve their ultimate performances in stadiums across the United States. Learn more about becoming a part of this exclusive inner circle of DCI's most committed fans online at dci.org slash friends. Once again, we welcome you to participate in this evening's Split the Pot raffle. One ticket for $5, three tickets for $10, and 10 tickets for $20. All money collected from tonight's raffle will be split between the Cavaliers and one lucky winner. Proceeds from the raffle help defray costs for food, gas, and other needs to help the Corps run smoothly. Thank you again for your partition and participation in tonight's Split the Pot raffle.
to ensure an enjoyable experience for everyone, please do not enter or leave the seating area during performances. Please wait until a core has completed its program before moving to and from your seat. Today's participating cores and your fellow fans, thank you for your cooperation. And also a reminder to, an, to all in attendance at this Drum Corps International Tour event, in order to protect the rights of the original composers and copyright owners, A reminder in, att in attendance at this Drum Corps International Tour event in order to protect the rights of the original composers and copyright owners who license their music to our performing ensembles. Drum Corps International and its participating organizations strictly prohibit the use of audio and video recording technology, including mobile devices and live streaming applications during this event. The participating course, thank you for co your cooperation and for complying with the law.